I'm, I'm half I'm half Jamaican um, from Jamaica um, and also my uh, my great great grandmother my great 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 grandfather is Irish so I'm like Jamaican Irish some like you know African so it's a little bit a little bit a little bit of everything any everybody in my family but mostly my dad and my uncles that's pretty much where I guess you know I get my I guess my genetics and my size and the type of person I am so I didn't really necessarily realize how big my dad was until other kids told me when I was at school you know he would come into school you know for like comp parents teacher parent teacher conferences or come to pick me up and you know people always be looking up at him like how big he is and you know different things like that so, I didn't really get a sense of how good I was in basketball and sports until I beat him. He was always like my measuring stick. So I was like, I didn't, you know, once I beat him for the first time in basketball or once I, you know, was able to, you know, play against him in, in football and other sports and beat him, that's when I knew that I, can, I could play at, you know, at a high level. I didn't even necessarily realize it, um, you know, that I was even close to this accomplishment. Um, my dad told me because my dad watches all the games and, you know, he was talking about it. Um, the commentary was talking about it. So, um, you know, for me, I mean, it's a, definitely a, a huge accomplishment. Um, it's a big milestone. And I mean, I'm happy that, you know, I've been able to, you know, play long enough, um, you know, to be able to reach something, um, some, some, something of this type of, uh, this type of achievement. I'm definitely, you know, nervous, but also excited about them uh, coming back. Um, like I said, it's been almost, you know, four months, three and a half months. So I really got to spend like a significant amount of time with them. I went home in January to, you know, see my newborn. Um, but I was most of the time I was spending with him. So I didn't really get a whole lot of chance to kind of spend with Anya. And still it was only two days. So she's grown so much. This is usually where, um, during the day, me and Anya are at all the time. I'm usually sitting here, she's sitting here. Um, we're usually reading books. She has a bunch of different books. This is one of her Russian books. We're trying to get her to kind of, a little bit of understand a little bit of Russian. Slowly but surely, I'm getting there. Um, I was in Avia Park yesterday, um, buying diapers. <laughs> And by, you know, you should have seen me yesterday. People were probably laughing at me. I had like, you know, my hands full of like, you know, two, you know, 58 packs of diapers and, you know, wipes and stuff like that. So I'm trying to get them uh, prepared. But um, majority of stuff they have here, um, just trying to get maybe some of the small stuff just to kind of get it prepared to make sure that, you know, they're, they're comfortable when they get here.